Minions, Minions Ghost Hunt. It was a spooky night at Gru's house, and the Minions were ready for fun. Bob, Kevin, and Stuart had just finished decorating the house with fake spider webs and pumpkins when they heard a strange noise coming from the basement. Whoa! A ghostly sound echoed up the stairs. The Minions froze, eyes wide, banana, whispered Bob, holding his favorite stuffed bear tightly. Kevin looked around nervously, and Stuart grabbed a flashlight. They tiptoed to the basement door. Kevin took a deep breath and opened it slowly. The door creaked, and a gust of cold wind blew out, making their overalls shiver. Oh! The ghostly noise came again, louder this time. The three minions stared at each other, then nodded. Ghost hunt time! Kevin led the way, flashlight in hand. Down the stairs they went, creeping quietly, their footsteps barely making a sound. As they reached the bottom, they saw shadows flickering on the walls. Oh! The spooky sound grew louder, Ruby. Bob asked nervously. Suddenly, something flew past them. The minions jumped in the air, screaming in their funny, squeaky way. Stuart shined the flashlight toward the flying object, and there it was, a floating white sheet, the minions gasped. Could it be a real ghost? They huddled together, shaking. But Kevin, always the brave one, stepped forward. He tiptoed toward the sheet, reaching out cautiously. As he got closer, the sheet stopped floating and fell to the floor with a soft thud. The minions blinked. Kevin leaned down and lifted the sheet, revealing a small fan and some string attached to the ceiling. Puka! Kevin muttered, scratching his head. It wasn't a ghost at all. Just then, the lights flickered, and the basement door slammed shut behind them. The minions screamed again, racing around in circles. Stuart tripped over a broom, Bob bumped into a shelf, and Kevin's flashlight started to flicker. It was chaos. Suddenly, there was a soft laugh. He 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 he. The minions stopped. That wasn't a ghostly sound, it was familiar. They looked up at the top of the stairs, where a tall figure appeared, holding a remote control, grew. Bob squealed with joy, waving his little arms. Gru chuckled as he walked down the stairs. You little goofballs, did you really think there was a ghost? He showed them the remote control that made the fan blow the sheet. I thought I'd give you a little scare for Halloween. The minion sighed in relief. It had all been a trick. They started laughing, too, feeling silly for being so scared. But then, just as they were about to head back upstairs, they heard it again, a soft, eerie yoho. The minions froze. Gru looked confused. That wasn't me, he said slowly. They all turned toward the dark corner of the basement, where a shadow seemed to move on its own. The minions clung to each other, eyes wide with fear, and then, out from the shadows floated. A real ghost, boo. It said playfully, before disappearing with a wink, the minions screamed and ran upstairs, laughing all the way. Halloween was going to be fun after all.